And we also have this breaking news coming to us out of Philadelphia. There are early reports of a shooting at an event celebrating Eid al-Fitr. This is the end of Ramadan. Uh, there are few details available at this moment, but as you see, uh, CBS News Philadelphia is covering this story, and we want to dip into their coverage and see what they're learning at this moment. What led to this latest gunfire in Philadelphia? This is West Philly that we're looking at. Again, a large police presence out there at this point, and folks still lingering about the area as police are continuing to investigate. So there's a flurry of activity, as you can see there from Chopper 3's aerial perspective. Again, our crews heading there on the ground. Hopefully they will get more information as police are setting up a staging area for the media to hopefully give us more information. And as soon as we get those details, we'll, of course, pass them along to you as quickly as possible. But again, several people already in custody, multiple people shot. This was some kind of a community event there at a park at 46th and Girard, 48th and Girard in West Philadelphia, Clara Muhammad Square. Park. Uh, that's what we're looking at now. That's where all of this transpired just before three o'clock this afternoon. Uh, it, some kind of a community event we understand was happening out there. Food trucks were there and still there. Tents are set up. So a very active scene playing out as police continue to investigate what may have prompted the gunfire. Multiple people shot, several people in custody. Chopper three hovering above a very active police investigation with a flurry of activity still happening and also a large police presence still there on the scene. So we're seeing again the Clara Muhammad Park here in West Philadelphia where this shooting happened. We're seeing plenty of tents that were set up out there, food trucks set up as well. So clearly some kind of an event was happening this afternoon. And that is where the gunfire transpired there at the park. So multiple people shot again, no idea as to how many just yet uh, and the conditions of those victims either. Still trying to gather that information as well. Uh, but again, this is West Philadelphia chopper hovering above this scene as we are waiting on our crews to make their way there to the scene to hopefully get more information also to talk to witnesses because we can only imagine this happening again at, at what seemed to have been a community event. There must have been multiple, multiple witnesses to this gunfire. Uh, multiple people shot. We can only imagine again multiple witnesses to this shooting as this was some kind of a community event with the tent set up, food trucks. You can see the massive police presence there trying to cordon off that scene and also many people still walking around that area uh, still likely processing what happened there this afternoon. Several people, though, in custody, still no idea as to a motive behind the shootings, no idea as to what may have sparked this violence. Uh, but this is West Philadelphia, 48th and Girard Avenue. Clara Muhammad Park is what we're looking at here from an aerial view, Chopper 3 hovering above there as we see a flurry of activity again. Police. Also, people that were attending this event still lingering around as police continue to investigate this shooting. Uh, again, uh, we're just hoping to get more information as police are setting up a staging area for the media. You can see the police presence there. Again, a large police presence to what was likely a large community event as we're seeing people still lingering around there even at this hour as they've cordoned off that park where this all happened. So we're, we're hoping to gather more information from our crews who are heading there on the ground, hopefully, to get more information from witnesses out there. There seems to be no shortage of them, likely, because this was a community event, it would appear, and many people still lingering around as police are continuing to investigate exactly what sparked this multiple shooting. So just to recap again, this is 48th and Girard in West Philadelphia, Clara Muhammad Park there. Multiple people shot. Some kind of a community event was happening there in that park. You can still see people lingering around. You can still see tents that were set up and food trucks that were there as well. Uh, but everything has been brought to a standstill now as police continue to investigate. Several people are in custody. We do know that much, but we don't know the catalyst behind this violence this afternoon in West Philadelphia. But still plenty of people there, again, uh, lingering around, possibly trying to figure out exactly what happened. Uh, there should be no shortage of witnesses for police to talk to 
as this was some kind of a community event that was happening there in West Philadelphia. So we, of course, are, are following all the details that we have, hoping to hear more from our ground crews as they make their way to this scene. It looks like a large scene as well. This was a large area that appeared to be having this community event, a large out just outside of the park as well. You can see there, it looks to be a school there possibly. Uh, it looks to be a school there in that area as well. We're not sure how they're affected or if at all at this point, um, but we'll hope to get that information for you as well. Chopper 3 widening out for us to give us some idea as to the scope of how large this uh, gathering may have been in that area of West Philadelphia. Multiple people shot this afternoon just before three o'clock. Several people in custody, still no idea as to the motive behind this. Also, no idea as to the condition of the victims in this case, but a large police presence there, as you can see, and necessarily so, because this does appear to be a large area uh, that was having this community event, a large part of that West Philadelphia area there at 48th and Girard where this community event was taking place today. Uh, so we still are trying to gather more information about what kind of an event this was, who was hosting it possibly, uh, how many people may have been out there uh, when all of this uh, started happening, when the shooting started happening just before three o'clock this afternoon. A uh, large police presence, everything has been shut down. It looked to me, I also saw what looked to be a SEPTA bus uh, or a trolley or something that was, was in the midst of all this being shut down as well. So there, there's no movement there, as you can imagine, as police continue to investigate this crime scene. So we're hoping to, to get our crews out there as quickly as possible. They're on the way. Chopper is giving us this vantage point from above, which really kind of shows you the magnitude and the scope of how large this investigation is and how large this community event may have been there in West Philly at 48th and Girard. Again, it looks to be a school there as well. Uh, a community event certainly taking place. We saw the tents, we saw the food trucks, we saw multiple people and can still see multiple people walking around and lingering around the area as police continue to investigate this crime scene at this point. Uh, so we, we are still waiting to hear more information about what may have been happening, what kind of an event this was, how many people again may have been there, but we can still see the residual effects of how big this was uh, with all the tents and the food trucks and the people still out there gathering uh, around that scene. So um, again, a, a, a huge scene, multiple police cars, multiple police cars around the area, multiple police officers in that park uh, standing there gathering more evidence and more information. So we are still waiting to, to hear more. There's a police staging area that's being set up as uh, we get more information, hopefully, from the ground and from police officers about what may have happened here at Clara Muhammad Square in West Philadelphia, 48th and Girard Avenue on a, a nice warm afternoon, ultimately, uh, and what looked to be possibly a community event uh, that was happening out there in West Philly on a nice warm Wednesday afternoon. So we're still hoping to... to We've been listening to CBS News Philadelphia carefully reporting what's known at this stage, which is that multiple people have been shot during some type of community event with several others in custody right now. It appears police will be um, addressing the media and sharing new information on this. And as soon as that happens, we'll bring it to you live.